we'll guide you through how to fix and lower input lag on your PS5. If you find this guide useful, consider subscribing and liking the video. So firstly, we actually need to go and change a setting on our monitor or TV. So go into your monitor settings or your TV settings. For me to go and get into my settings, for some reason, I need to turn off my PS5. When I go and click on the options button on my remote here, it goes and like opens up my PS5 settings. So yeah, I have to turn my PS5 off or put it into rest mode. So I'll put my PS5 into rest mode now, just like that. Now that it's switched off, I can then click on the options button on my remote and I then go and get these settings on the side. And I want to click on scene select like this. You may need to go into picture and then I can choose game. Once you've changed that setting, turn your PS5 back on. For the next fix, what you want to do is connect your controller using its cable. So because you're using Bluetooth, that could be a cause of input lag. So plug the charging cable in, the USB into your uh, console, and then plug the USB-C into your controller like this. And then we need to go to our settings. So go up to the top right and click on the settings cog and then go down to accessories down here and then go down to controller general and you want to click on communication method, click here and then you click on use uh, USB cable. You can change this back in the future but using the USB cable is gonna go and remove the sort of wireless part and by using a direct connection should go and lower the lag you're getting with Bluetooth. If you found this useful, then please leave a like.